just felt I had to uh, give a little message. You know, a huge day coming up for this England team, my England team. What I say, my England team, it's not my England team, but having represented, I was just trying to think to myself about thoughts, mindsets, how you're feeling. It's like, wow, it makes the hair stand up on the back of my neck now, and I've got nothing to do with it. But I think ultimately, to think about it in a sense, uh, but certainly that I did, is that you know, this is the moment. It's no next debrief, recovery session, what's going on, planning, strategies, next week, the week after, because ultimately it's the next game. And the pressures that come with that, the mindset which comes with that, it's, it's, it's hard, it's tough. And this is who you'll find out exactly who can stand up and who can deliver. But that's not in a threatening way, it's a way to enjoy it. You know, big occasion, big players, big decisions. This is why you train, this is why you do it, this is why you sacrifice, this is why you stay away from home for long periods of time, train, push in the gym, analyzing recovery, physios, pain, necks, move on, stronger, faster, fitter, better, more skillful, rain, cold, miserable, sleet, snow. You know, this is about now, delivering it now, bring it out of yourself. God, you know, why am I so pumped up? <laughs> But I think that's my message to my England team. You do all that for moments like this. And if you can deliver it, give your very best. And your very best will always be good enough for me. And you can look around that changing room when you come home, look at loved ones, friends, family, coaches, and know that you gave everything. Nobody can ever ask more of you. But that takes courage, guts, determination. I'm with you, boys. Go and get it.